Hello everyone and welcome to Sapphire Cuts TV with me your host Ammo HD. Thank you for joining me in another episode of Horizon Zero Dawn here on this channel on YouTube. Um, thank you for watching previous episodes and the playlists and liking and commenting and please keep it coming it does help the channel grow I cannot do this without your support and um, please also um, share and subscribe if you haven't already and this these are other two methods that help as well and if you'd like to contact me on social media details are in the description one quick uh, bit of news update I have decided that I will not I repeat I will not be covering Death Stranding um, as I feel it's a game that takes up too much time when I have so many other more prominent games that need playing um, and I think that I may revisit this game maybe nearer the time when it comes out on PC next summer um, I've heard many mixed reviews and for, for the money that it's being priced at I think it's too much at the moment and it's, it's, it takes up too much of my time I do really want to get into the Yakuza series um, I've bought Yakuza 6 today I already have Yakuza 0 and Yakuza Kiwami, the first one. And then 3 and 4 have been released. 4 has just been released this week. I think so. Or was shortly. And then there's another one coming out for January or February next year. Which will probably be number 5. Um, these are all remasters. So I will want to be covering them as well as other games like Fist of the North Star, Burning Paradise. Uh, check out the demo that I've already played through on the playlist and there's other games as well so just to let you know Death Stranding will not be covered by me right now but what will be covered by me right now is the continuation of this game right okay so Erend has found his sister in the most unfortunate of circumstances um, so just give me one second and pick this up. This machine's been picked apart with precision. Alright, we will come back to that in a minute. We should go and talk to him. Just give me some time with Ursa. Okay. Fair enough. What's Derval learned from all his tinkering? Do I even want to know? I guess we're going to have to at some point. Okay, what's this one over here? Derval's records, maybe. Just notes about crafting. And a letter tucked between the pages. Lots of blaze. Headed to Meridian. If we find it, I'll bet we find Derval too. Taking too long, forget about that. Right, next. It's such a strange device. It's beautifully crafted. What happens when I turn it on? I think I've got it working. There. <laughs> now, let's say something. Both of you does. I don't know. What do you want me to say? Whatever you want. I, I just want to hear your voice and keep it for later. 
I'll sing, Papa. La 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 la. <laughs> There, a song and a laugh, even better than words. And I can hear them whenever I want. We're done then? Off to bed with you. Good night, Mama. Good night, Papa. Is she gone? What are we going to do? The raids are getting closer and closer to Main Spring. How much longer can we hide like this? We keep safe from his family. Devil's got nothing left to lose. I think I found something that can help. Let's head back to the palace. Go. I won't be long, but I need to tend to my sister. Okay. Oh, I'm great. So I've got to do this on my own. Palace of the Sun Rays, so we'll go back to where we were before. Good roll. I wasn't expecting that. I was half thinking she's gonna um, lose some life. Right, how about. That's the one. Oh, this made his travelling so much easier. But then, do we even need this? Can we just fast travel and... Let's just go there. Right, so this way. See, that was handy. It's good then we've got enough of those fast travel packs. All right, merchant. All right. What did you want to discuss? You're an Outlander, which is good, but a Nora, which might be bad. Do you fear the ruins of the old ones, like many in your tribe? No, although some can be dangerous. Then you may have come across what I seek. In your travels, have you found strange vessels emblazoned with symbols of the old ones? They consist of a hollow cylinder with a crescent handle affixed at both ends. If you bring me these vessels in sets of four, I will gladly trade what I have for them. Um, I ain't got time I for that now. I will leave you to the hunt. Be sure to delve into the ruins. Perhaps your travels have taken you through ancient ruins? Let us speak of it. Um, all of that's gonna have to wait. I know that there's legendary armor in this game. I'm interested in that. That'll make the game a lot easier, but for now we're gonna have to do it the old fashioned way, the hard way. about her son. To learn she lives, then lose that hope, seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun. Tell him what you found in his papers. A letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. The name was Ayland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. 
It's by the edge of the mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Aaron, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. <clears throat> Aloy, a moment, please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? She wasn't worried about her pain. She was worried about her brother. And she was worried about you. Thank you, Aloy. I suppose I needed to know I was as much on her mind as she is on mine. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. I will. But once this threat to Meridian is dealt with, another one looms. We have to talk about the Eclipse. We will. I promise. Alright, now what? Go to the warehouse. Okay, let's find this warehouse with this, um... Troublemaker on the loom. On the horizon. <laughs> so there's a rumor that Horizon Zero Dawn 2 has already started to be made. And or that there's a VR version of it being made. What do you guys think of that? Let me know in the comment section. Would any of you buy the VR version? Have any of you actually got PlayStation VR right now? And how is it? Because I don't have one. What are they doing? Preferably with no friends or family. That must be the spire. Why does King Bard protest you? Whoops. This is the place. You home, Durval? I got a surprise for you. That doesn't look good. Or he has a surprise for us. Is it a bomb? Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. If I try to take it apart, a booby trap will set it off. Booby trap. <laughs> okay. Um, search the warehouse. Alright, let's go upstairs. If that bomb goes off, the blaze will ignite in a firestorm. That's a lot of blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off, it'll be just what Durval promised. Smoke will darken the sun. As the city goes up in flames, there's there's got to be a way to stop it. If we can get rid of it somehow, the blast will be much smaller. supposed to do that then if we can get rid of it somehow the blast will be much smaller uh, so is uh is, is that thing gonna go off mm. how can I move it then Looks like a wooden bracket. Not very strong. Well, I was thinking something. I didn't know it was going to be that easy. 
Komm. Help me push this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is gonna get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Uh. We did it! Durval's best shot. Durval said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. Now that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. If he tries for the palace, he's finished. Investigate the area. Or what? What am I supposed to look for? I'm not supposed to be looking for here. Food tracks. With just a bit of blaze in them. Guards, bring water or a fire might spread to the hunter's lodge. There's a trail, I'm not seeing it. There we go. That's why. Can I interest you in a reasonable share of a lucrative opportunity? Only the finest goods here. Like See for yourself. What happened? I haven't heard a blast like that since the liberation. A moment of your time, Outlander? There's smoke rising from the edge of the mesa. Are we under attack? The tracks lead inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. Okay. All right. The bookcase does it move? And now it comes up. That point that took ages to come up. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. <sighs> he tunneled through the wall. Durval did find a way into the palace. annoying.
try and secure them. Get on my nerves, man. I've done this the first time and then I died because auto cling didn't work. Wish I could be there to see the sun god on his knees. Quit carping, you chuff. Someone's got to guard the rear. Someone better guard your rear. Handy. So what? None of them are gonna move. I'll just tag them a second ago. Okay, that's good. Right now, what? Where am I supposed to go from here? So I guess I'm about to do some more. Well, I was going to say I'm going to have to do more climbing, but it's not. It's like not. to enjoy watching the Karja burn, even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian Avad. Breathe in the stench and choke on the ashes. Something's wrong. It didn't... I, I didn't hear anything. There's a bit of smoke rising. It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner. I can't leave everyone at the mercy of that machine.
craft pouch upgrade available, right? Okay. It's just this one, is it? No, none of them. So why is it telling me that for then? Anytime. Skills, mm, not enough. Okay. All right, come back to that. What's this? Oh, you must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp and disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First, yours. Then Avaz. Oh shit, he's got a rattler. Contact! Can we finish this? Oh yeah. A savage is nothing. I've led an army. That's bullshit, man. Ravages. A savage is nothing. Can we finish this? I've got a sun god to kill. Oh shit. Does a Vard always have his lady? I've led an army. Killed kestrels and ravagers. A savage is nothing. You still got it all to do, my friend. I've led an army. Killed kestrels and ravagers. A savage is nothing. Can we finish this? I've got a son got to kill. It's not over yet. No, oh, that was... I'm Tinker will tell you. Always have a third plan. This cannot be good. Oh shit, it's getting on like the nearest Targaryen from Game of Thrones. We've been messed up a couple of times already. Um, so... We might want to change... Some of our weapons. OK, 
Okay. Let's fling. I put that on. Yeah, we don't need trip caster for this one. Okay. Never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you. I hope you like fighting these things, because there's more in the way. I do actually. Oh shit, man, give me a break. Ah, those majestic, murderous glint hawks. Grab this while I can. Why? Sit down. Give me your shit at the same time. Alright, let's get this one here. I hope you like fighting these things, because there's more in the way. Okay. Lucky. Oh, okay. It's like that. That's fine. Never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you. this now so I, I was able to equip more um, <clears throat> weapons but it's just it doesn't have it's not a great way of showing me how to do it Keep moving, God, keep moving. Alright. Oh, hey, you weren't expecting that, were you? Now's my chance. Come on! 
Take this goddamn potion. Man, they make some weird noises, man. Oh shit, use my own shit against me. Majestic, murderous glint hawks. Yeah, you got murked by me. Let's see if there's anything else that they left on the floor for me to pick up. I am in bad condition. Yep, there is. I knew there was something. What's that noise? I can hear something from behind me. What is this pecker wood? As much as I wish Ursa was here to kill you, I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Aaron, you'll screw it up! I know what you are afraid of. Going back to Mainspring in chains. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now. Damn, I like the lighting in this scene. That's unexpected. Right now what? Avard, Erin and Devo. Alright, so where are uh, is everyone? Go if you're lost. A guard, not the town crier. Oh, I don't want to talk to you anyway. Please, I, I need a moment to gather myself. I believe Aaron wants to speak to you. It's always the ones you least okay, so I need to see Tim first, is it? Aloy. I was just thinking about Ursa. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place, to put him down. But she also told me to grow up. I gotta admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do. Right? <laughs> You're asking me? I'm pretty sure you're older. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? You did with Durval. Now, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. What do you think the Osirim will do to Durval? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. I can live with that. 
In fact, I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. So, after all this, what's next for Errand Vanguardsman? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get in touch with my clan and we'll lay Ursa to rest properly. Like how she would have wanted. And by that I mean less chit chat, more drinking. Well. I know, you gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master, all before breakfast. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. And now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Oh, you're such a smooth talker. <laughs> Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. I hate to tell you this after everything you've been through, but there's another fight brewing and I need your help. Helis and his fanatics are coming from Meridian. No rest for the weary, huh? Well, don't worry. I'll be there for you. This one next. I have a matter of grace and beauty I would like to discuss with you. Come on, man, how far is it? Come to gloat, Nora. Well, as you can see, I'm busy. Is that it? Alright. That was a waste of time. I thought I was going to get a new cutscene or a new bit of information. Could you spare a moment to speak of the finer things? Aloy, to say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You saved Meridian. And because of you, there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. Avad, stop. There's something urgent we have to... I know, but please, just listen for a moment. I want you to stay in Meridian. What? Why? Well, to start with, you kept the city from going up in flames. You're strong, shrewd, uh, capable. I could use someone like you at my side. It might be worth taking a moment to examine what you just said. You just lost Ursa, a woman who stood at your side and could easily be described as strong, shrewd, and capable. It's pretty clear how you felt about her. And now you're asking me to take her place. Is this a job offer or a proposition? By the sun, you do indeed share much with Ursa. Including a withering eye for foolishness. Ah. Please. Accept my apologies. Seems I'm getting ahead of myself. I need some time. To resolve my feelings. Huh. But you had something urgent to discuss? 
Helis is preparing to attack Meridian. It could come at any time. By the sun. Wait a moment. I want Marat to hear this. Aloy. The Sun King tells me that you bring grave news. Please, tell us what you know. The Eclipse will attack soon, from the west, with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them, god, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Fortify the Western Ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight, where the Spire rests. Aloy. Allow me to... Apologize for my behavior before. After everything that happened with Ursa, I was confused. If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, I'd prefer to do so with your forgiveness. Then you have it. As long as you don't confuse me with her again. Even a king can learn his lesson. Good then. I'm. I'm glad that's behind us. Now, it will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. Everything. I don't know about everything, but I'll tell you what I can. <laughs> 